<laughs> You've met with a terrible fate, haven't you? Yes, I have. I own the Happy Mask Shop. I travel far and wide in search of masks. So hang on. The world ended, but we're back here. <laughs> what? Yes, precious item. I remember all of this. It is a difficult task. I know you're a very busy fellow, but you're not very busy. As far as I can tell, you were just standing there for three days. I don't believe that you're actually busy. I'm happy to see you guys are populating the quote bot tonight. A kid playing the original Zelda, where would he go meet his friends and talk about the game on a weekend? Gosh. I don't know. Well, see, the thing is, like, I talked about games with my friends, like, at school, so... <laughs> the cafeteria. We died, but we didn't die. What the? You're wearing a mask. That I haven't seen before. Deposit mail here, ka-ching. Yeah, I'm, I don't want to do that yet. Hey, come back here. What's your story? I'm curious now. I don't know mine, and I wasn't keeping track. Oh, hey! Hello, fairy. Okay. Bum ba da 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 ba 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 da da ba Okay, so let's go to the Great Fairy Fountain. Reassemble the fairy. So is there not, is there like not really a game over? Is it just like you just get tossed back to the beginning of the three days if the moon crashes and kills you? Yep, yep, we've read all this before. Give me some magic, yo. Give me some magic, magical fairy lady. Oh, that's cool. That's cool, fish. Oh, man. I have, uh... I know that... I know a couple of you guys were throwing around some Ace Attorney quotes earlier, and that reminds me. I have... I have Spirit of Justice. I've only played through the first case. I got it, like, back in January. Like, I played through the first case on the flight to MAGFest. And I haven't touched it since then. It's been... So it's been, like, four, almost five months. I should really pick that back up again. Okay. 
Alright, so now let's go bust that balloon. And let's be a little more deliberate. A little more systematic about... Now we're searching for these kids. Whoops. Whoops. Dang it. Alright, there we go. That's right! I broke the balloon! Me! Let's do this! Alright, well I know where four of you are. Okay. There's definitely a, there you are. I'll get you. Ah, come back here, you little rascal. There we go. Haha, <laughs> I caught you. Okay. Hi, Tattle. Do you have anything of value to say? No, you do not. All you do is complain. Okay. Um, can I save? Out of curiosity? Oh, is like saving not an option? Okay. Interesting. Also, why is Tingle up there on a balloon? Totally missed, but I'm not gonna deal with that now. Okay, um. Let's see. Let's, let's like try to search everything in this area first. Oops, that's not the button I wanted to press. Let's do this. Oops. That is not what I wanted to do. Go, 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 go! There we go. Wouldn't by any chance be down here. Nope. Okay. I just wanted to make sure. Yeah, I had a feeling, yeah, mine and I had a feeling this game was about trial and error. <laughs> and, uh, no, being, being a former teacher, I typically do not feel bad about messing up because that is what learning is all about. Learning involves messing up a lot. Messing up is not a bad thing. It is a is a good thing as long as you use those mess ups to to grow and change and figure things out. And that is my wisdom for the evening. <laughs> hey, invisible opinion. How dare you spoil it? Everybody dies. Oh no. Well, what's the point of even going on now? All right. Okay, so that's Code Kid. That's not a kid I'm actually after. Here's Chicken Kid. I mean, Cuckoo Kid. Come back here, Cuckoo Kid! I'm gonna mess you up, see? Your parents will weep at your grave when I'm through with you. I don't want to talk to you. Ugh. Ah. Hey. I'm trying to trying to get Cuckoo Kid here. You guys are cramping my style. There we go. No, I don't want to deposit mail. 
No! Game! What are you doing? Now I've like totally lost- there he is. Ah! Get back here, you slippery little varmint. Ah, there's two of them now. No fair, why do you get to hide behind the guard? There we go. Caught ya. Night of the first day. Why does that kid get to hide back there? That's not fair. Oh, come on. Let me, let me grab him. Let me grab him. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, dang it. Come on. So close. There we go. Now he's out and about. Come on. Come back here. Come back here. Ah, no Z targeting. What are you doing? Get back here. Oh my gosh. Come on. Come on. What the heck? Seriously, I'm gonna have to start over. Oh, I lost him. There we go. Okay, only two left. Okay, I, th I feel like I hear one. Definitely hear someone. Oh my gosh! Was he back in that corner the whole time? Oh, you! All right, I'll just wait here for you. Come on, run to me! Run to me! Run into my arms! Come on! I have you trapped! Come on! Come on! Oh, you're just stalling, you jerk. There we go. Okay. Oh, where was that last one? That last one was... Oh, I don't have the map anymore. Um, but that last one was in... I think West Clock Town. Okay, so this is South Clock Town. I'm gonna have to buy that map again, aren't I? Hey, Kaysonia! Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the Brenomaniacs. Huzzah! Hey, Kaysonia, happy, uh, happy Tuesday to you. Thanks for dropping by, and thank you for the follow. Did I ever find the boss man? Um, I don't think I know about the boss man yet. I just started playing this. Okay. I hear... I hear a child. I just need to grab the child. There he is. Yes! <laughs> oh, no way! You finally got me! That's right. I stalked and hunted down every one of you. If only I were human, yes. Oh, the red-headed kid. Gotcha. Yeah, yeah. I couldn't... That was the kid that I couldn't find and, like, indirectly caused the apocalypse last time. If you were human, I could give you an original bomber's notebook and make you a member. What do you guys think? No way! No scrubs! I don't want no scrub. Scrub is the guy that can't get no love from me. Hanging out the passenger side of his best friend's ride. Trying to holler at me. Yep. Oh yeah, that's right. This is a blind playthrough. Thanks, mine, for the reminder. So that means, uh, so no backseating, uh, no spoilers, please. Um, please don't offer me advice or hints unless I specifically ask for it. Um, but otherwise, sit back and relax and enjoy the playthrough. Um, but 
if you need a uh, space to discuss what's going on in the game, I do have a Discord. I could make a channel for people who, like, want to talk about what's happening in the game while I'm playing it. Um, and, like, discuss spoilers and stuff without me seeing. Um, I could make, like, kind of a spoiler safe zone in the Discord if people would be interested in that. Um, so just, just tossing that idea out there. Let me know what you guys think of that. Alright, I guess not. Once we let some kid who wasn't human join our gang, and boy, did we ever regret it. Sorry. But I'll teach you the code, just like I promised. I can only tell you once, though, so pay close attention. Okay, guys, help me remember the code. One, two, three, four, five. Or four, five, two, one, three. <laughs> okay, four, five, two, one, three. All right, 45213. To East Clock Town we go. Thanks, Kisonia. All right, 45213. All right, four. Whoops. Four, five, two, one, three. Um, that's right. If you know the code, then you remember, right? Okay, here you go. Yes! There's a lot of cool stuff in the telescope guy's place. Oh yeah, and uh, the Bomber Secret Society of Justice Forever. <laughs> the Bomber Secret Society of Justice. Oh, is that a thing they never mentioned? Okay, that's interesting. No wonder Skull Kid is so angry and wants to destroy the world. He got kicked out of the Bombers Club. I love that Deku Scrub Kid can... Deku Scrub Link can, like, walk on water. Oh, gosh! But I need to get back to land. Okay, there we go. Oh, gosh! Ah, oh, fiddlesticks. Okay, let's try this again. There we go. Take that, Skulltula. I just killed you with my spit. With my sputum. wonder how the astronomer knows a Skull Kid. Oh, look at the time! You don't even have three days left! Yes, and you're wasting my time by talking to me about how I don't have time. Oh, gosh. Okay. Um, hmm, which way to go? So th let me just make sure this way is a dead end. Yeah, okay. Yeah, you know what, Kaysonia? I've I've had this game for years, actually. Like I bought it a long time ago, and I just never actually got around to playing it. Um, but now I finally am. And I have a feeling I am in for quite, quite a rousing good time. Okay, so I don't think I can exactly go that way. So, hmm. Oh, let's see. I can go here, I can go here, I can go here. Uh-oh. The game is about to give us an ominous message. Dawn of the second day. 48 hours remain. <laughs> Hmm. Okay. So wait. Oh, geez. There's a door right there. Oh my god. I just plain. Oh my god, guys. So me and doors. I just plain did not see that door. <laughs> oh, good lord. 
This is the third Zelda game you played? Um, the third Zelda game I played... Well, Link to the Past, actually, was the third Zelda game I played, because I played the first two and they came out. Um, okay, so there is a balloon there. That I can probably pop. Hey guys, remember at the beginning of the stream when... I was like, how do you unlock this door? And I just walked up to the door and opened it. And I was like, oh, oh, that's how it's done. <laughs> All right. I am an okay gamer. Oh, I've heard this tune before. Hello, what have you here? Is this a scarecrow thinger? I can talk to scarecrows? Yo, hey, baby. I am a style and scarecrow wandering in search of pleasant music. Time will pass in the blink of an eye if you dance with... Dance with me. If you like, baby, we can forget the time and dance until night. Uh, let's not dance. I have a feeling I don't necessarily want to advance time right now. Maybe later. I know of a mysterious song that allows you to manipulate the flow of time. Do you want to learn it? Sure. Let's learn it. Oh yeah! Now listen up! If you play that strange song backward, you can slow the flow of time. And if you play each note twice in a row, you can move a half day forward through time. How's that? Pretty interesting, isn't it? But I'm sure I'd like any song written by you better, baby. If you like, you can play one for me. All right. Um. So let's go up these stairs. Ah, there we go. Come on, camera, you can do it. Ooh, this is pretty. You've beaten five Zelda games, Kasonia. That's awesome. I don't think I've played Four Swords Adventures. Um, let's see, I've beaten... I've beaten the original Zelda. I have not beaten the Adventure of Link, though. Like, I got to the last dungeon. But it's so hard. I've beaten Link to the Past many times. Uh, I've beaten Ocarina of Time. Um, and Wind Waker, and Twilight Princess, and Skyward Sword, and Breath of the Wild. And Link's Awakening. I started playing Phantom Hourglass, but I didn't get very far. Oh, there's the guy I want to talk to. Well, well, a strange-looking child has joined me today. Are you a new friend of the Bombers Gang? Hmm, your manners seem much better than those of your mischievous friend from the other day. Mischievous friend, you say? Perhaps the Skull Kid? So, Link to the Past was my favorite Zelda game until I played Breath of the Wild, and Breath of the Wild is actually now my favorite. Yeah, I got Breath of the Wild for Wii U, um, because I already had a Wii U. Like, I wanted to get a Switch, but, um, A, like, they sold out everywhere, and B, I was like, you know, I really want to play the new Zelda, and, like, why shell out $300 for a new system when I can just get it for the system I already have, so. Anyway, what's going on with the story here? That ill mannered troublemaker from the other day said he'd break my instruments. He said he'd steal my moon's tear but there was no stopping him. Even now, just watch him. He's probably causing trouble around the clock tower. Will you gaze into the telescope? Yes, let's let's go ahead and gaze into the telescope. Oh, nice. Mine, how are you liking the Switch, by the way? Like, was it worth, worth the price? Smart, that's totally okay that you haven't beaten a Zelda game, because they are challenging. Lock tower. Oh, I see. There's the skull kid. Is 
Skull Kid looking up at the moon. Oh, that's a moon tier. That's definitely a moon tier. <laughs> and we are being mooned by the Skull Kid. Well, did you find that troublemaker? And that loud noise, what was that? Perhaps another moon steer has fallen nearby. Go through that door and take a look outside. But I wonder how that troublemaker got on top of the clock tower. The only way up there is through the clock door, and that opens only on the eve of the carnival. Magic. Totally worth it, awesome. Never put the arm straps on your Joy-Cons. All right, well, when I do eventually get a Switch, I will have to keep that in mind. You used to think the moon tier was actually moon snot. <laughs> That's awesome, smart. I mean, who's to say it's snot? <laughs> oh my. All right, I got the moon's tier. Oh, and I can give it to the Deku in South Clock Ten, because I think he wanted a Moon Steer, if I remember correctly. It was a Moon something. Coffee. Isn't it late for what time is it where you are, Casonia? Because where I am, it's 10 p.m., and I would definitely not be drinking coffee at this time. What could that troublemaker be doing at clock top the clock tower? I just hope he's not plotting another one of his no-good tricks. Okay, so I've got- I got a moon tier. Um... So that's probably what I came for, right? Because I know that I can give the moon tier to someone in Clock Town. Alright, so we know where the Skull Kid is. Let's go ask her on the Clock Tower. Maybe we'll learn something. Whoa, look at the time! Don't even have two days left! Yes, I know. Time is fleeting. Oh dear. Whoops. I miss... Judge that. Oh gosh. Ah! I am not good at not drowning. Oh jeez! Get back over there! Okay. Alright, there we go. Coffee doesn't really affect you? Okay. Ten PM for you. Gotcha. So just enjoying a nice evening cup of coffee. That's cool. I usually have a couple cups in the morning when I get to work. And that's about it for me. It's kind of a nice ritual thing. It's very calming to me to have my morning cup of coffee. Um, so what am I doing? I'm going to clock ta the clock tower. Yes, let's do that. I totally don't have a map either. Wait, wait, hang on. Tea is also good. Sometimes I'll have a cup of tea in the afternoon at work. Once in a while. I think I, actually I think I have some berry flavored teas in my desk at work. Maybe I'll have one tomorrow. You like day two of Clocktown mining? That's awesome. Let's see. Well, I happen to have a moon's tear, good sir. I happen to have one. Here you are. Ah, that stone! You must hand it over to me! In exchange, I'll give you my spot here. Deku flower included, yes? 
Traded the moon steer for a land title deed. Excellent. <laughs> I've got a deed. The title deed for this spot should be in high demand among Deku Scrubs, but you already know that. If you don't need it anymore, you can always sell it. Alright, so I can do something now. Oh, sweet tea. Nice. Night of the second day. Alright, the question is, where do I want to launch myself to? Let's talk to this guy. Tis tis, Brock. I wonder if this will make it. Okay, so I was able to launch myself there, but where else can I launch myself to? No, I didn't want to use that. I want to talk to Tattle. No, I don't want to use that. Okay. You're a Deku, so why don't you try using this Deku flower? Okay. Hi, dog! Yes. Ah! Dang it, dog. Why did you try to murder me? Okay. Uh, come on, dive into the flower. There we go. There we go. All right. Uh, am I able to get up here? Yes. 